All right. Good morning, Sharonda. How are you today? I'm doing great. How are you? I am doing well. So I've got your resume here in front of me. You've applied to an IT support technical position. You have a fantastic background in technical support. So let's start with your most recent position at Asurion that you worked at from 2018 until present. Tell me a little bit about that position and what a typical day looked like for you in that role. Uh, well, a typical day was we were receiving inbound calls and inbound chats regarding people trying to set up their Wi-Fi. Uh, they lost connection. Their cell phones weren't connecting to the server to get wireless service. So we supported fixing that. Basically, anything that had to do with Internet service, we fixed hands on Bluetooth alarms, TVs, cell okay. phones, just about anything, laptops. We got them connected and running to internet. So you were doing chat and calls at the same time, correct? Yes, yes. Beautiful. How many calls were you? Um, would you say you're probably fielding per day? Um, on a slow day, I'll say anywhere from sixty to seventy days to okay. seventy. On a busy day, we easily hit two hundred because they're like back to back. But they were both basically the same call, so they were like repertory. So you knew how to get them off quick. Like this is your solution. This is how we're gonna fix it. And right. it was easier to get them off that way. Fantastic. Now, what if you were in a situation having to deal with maybe a more difficult customer, maybe someone that was not so happy? How did you handle that type of situation? Oh, well, I would always let them vent, tell me what the problem was. You know, a lot of the times they just want to get it all out. So once they got it all out, I'll go ahead and go to, okay, so this is how we're going to help this and get this done in a one call resolution. And then I'll follow back up with you in a couple of days and make sure it's still working properly. So I would go through the steps to get it resolved and a couple of days follow up and make sure everything was still working correctly. All right. Fantastic. And prior to that, you were working at CBS Health. And what I really liked about this position is the fact that you deal, dealt with billing and that you got some exposure to that side of things. Were you also having to do collections as well in that position? Um, not so much as collections. It was a follow up of, hey, we haven't received the payment. Uh, okay. When you, do we need to set up a different date for us to collect the payment or what would be the best option for them? Really wasn't like harassing, like, hey, this needs to be paid before okay. it gets cut off or something like that. So more customer service based than yes. aggressive collections. I like yes. that. All right. Beautiful. And then and you spent, it looks like, three years at that company and the prayer that you were four years as a dispatcher. Tell me about your dispatching role. Oh, this, oh that, that was my favorite. I was kind of mad they sold the company. But, well, I started out as a driver there. I know the Orlando area really good. So they took my mom's a truck driver as well. So I was familiar with how to get around detours and what was okay. the best route. So it was just like second nature to when I got transferred over to dispatch. So I, I was every time they would call in with an accident, I'm like, hey, well, we could take this side street and jump back on route here and pick up and everything is still on time. So that was one of my favorite. It was like a puzzle all day. <laughs> well, okay. all of my was like a puzzle, but that one was like mainly a puzzle because it was live right then and it had to be done then. All right. Fantastic. And you are located in a COE. Now you were aware that the position that you applied for is on site, correct? Yes. All right. Beautiful. Um, and this position is located in downtown Orlando. That's a commutable distance for you. Yes. All right. Beautiful. Sharonda, I'm going to chat with you a little bit more off camera. If that sounds good to you. That's fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs>